killer bumblebees are about to attack this rainbow friend, and it's my job to save him. Don't worry there, you little round fella. We're gonna go ahead and draw a giant dome around your head. And there we go. The bumblebees can't get in. Take that, you dumb bumblebees. Oh, look how happy he is. So the objective of this game is super simple. We just need to draw barriers to make sure that the killer bumblebees aren't able to get to the rainbow friend and sting him to death. At the top of the screen, you guys can see that there's actually different levels that, that we can get and different amounts of stars that we can unlock. So the less we draw, the more stars we can actually get. All right, this time around, let's actually see. Can we trap the bees in their hive? Let's see. Is that actually a strategy? I think it is. Oh, no. Wait a second. Okay, they're falling. I think it's okay. The bumblebees got trapped in my giant turd. Okay, level four. Let's see. How do we save the rainbow friend? Let's actually get creative with this one. Let's draw a giant circle with eyeballs. That looks good. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. All right, we dropped them on the spikes, and the bumblebees are actually dying to the spikes. Oh, that is sick. I didn't know that that could happen. All right, this time around, the rainbow friends are floating. So what I'm thinking we could do is uh, go like this, go like that, draw a little something like that, come back down, and I made a giant fat banana pear. I think it actually is going to work. As long as I close off the drawing that I make, I don't really have to worry too much about the bumblebees. But every single level that we pass is going to get just a little bit more difficult than the last one. And they're going to start adding in more rainbow friends. So right now we have three rainbow friends and we need to make sure that all of the blue guys don't fall into lava or get stung by the bumblebees. So this is what I'm thinking. We're gonna draw a little circle down there. Something like that. And then we're gonna draw a little circle so that they're not able to bring us over the edge, right? We need to latch it on and then we need to contain all of the rainbow friends up there. There we go. All right, there we go. Not bad at all. We're doing a great job. I'm actually really proud of myself. All right, that was only level six. Level seven is looking a little bit more difficult. What I'm thinking we could do is lock the bumblebees in a giant triangle. Okay. I didn't quite realize that my guys were going to fall directly into the spike. So we need to reevaluate here. Maybe what I could do is go up from here, draw a circle around that, and then we'll go down from here, just like that. And now we have a giant dream looking character. Right, that actually worked out great. So they're not falling into the spikes and the bumblebees are running directly into the barrier that we drew. Suck on that, bumblebees. All right, so far so good, ladies and gentlemen. Now we're only on level eight, so we need to worry about lock in this one, the bumblebees, and I think that's probably it. There's only one of the blue characters. So this is what I'm thinking, right? We're gonna draw my good friend named Stan. That is Stan. We're gonna make sure he's got like a little mouth right there and a little eyeball. Stan is a worm coming up from the ground and Stan is gonna make sure that blue is safe. Stan, Stan, what the flip, Stan? You were supposed to make sure he didn't die, Stan. What are you doing, Stan? All right, well, this time around, we're gonna need to hook Stan to the edge here. All right, Stan, there you go. Just a little worm. Happy face worm. We're gonna make a little eyeball for him. All right, this time around, Stan is a happy guy. And he's gonna make sure that Blue does not die. Thank you very much, Stan. That's what we like to see. All right, this time around, I think we could actually just, like, make a box, right? We can make a Minecraft block. Does that work? Oh, yeah, it does. All right, look, they're all gonna run into the spike. Oh, we killed all the bumblebees. Oh, yeah, dude. I don't even think that was possible, but we did it. We broke through my expectations, and we beat the game, or at least that level. Okay, this time around, what I'm thinking we could do is make an infinity sign around this, and then somehow we need to make sure that this doesn't fall, so we're gonna circle that. We still have three stars. Blue should be safe. Oh, yeah, dude, that was amazing. Look at that. We got rid of the bumblebees. We got rid of the spike ball. We did everything right. Awesome. Now Blue can go home to his family and children. Okay, this one I'm actually not entirely sure how to beat. So Blue is definitely going to fall down into this abyss. So we need to lock that off and then we need to circle around here just like that. I think that's it. Oh no, no, no. Okay. All right. I think we failed this one successfully. Oh wow. Okay. That was epic. We actually beat that one. All right. Go me. Go me. Let's go. That was pretty good. Wow. There's four of them. Now. All right, boys, I'm going to need you to listen up. Every single one of you is going to get out of this A-OK. -okay. All you got to do is trust me. We're going to trap the bumblebees. All right, we're going to trap the bumblebees up there. Then we're going to make a giant stick figure that has legs, very tiny baby legs, very tiny baby arms. This should work. Yes. No, oh, wait, they're going to fall. Stop spitting. Stop. You, you stay. Stay right there. Yes. It's a real good thing the time limit is only five seconds because if that kept going, I don't think blue would have survived. All right, what's this one? What does it want me to do? Can I draw through this? Wait, oh gosh. Oh, uh, um. Oh, that goes upside down and, and okay. All right. I understand what just happened. Okay. Okay. No, we, we, we should be able to fix it. Okay. So if I go under this, right, we can lock him in there and then that way it just goes up, it goes down and the bumblebees aren't going to be able to get him, right? His crown is exposed, but it doesn't matter. The bumblebees don't need to sing the crown. Crown isn't a part of blue. 
This one, I don't know if I like, honestly. Uh, so there is a spike ball that's about to swing down and destroy Blue's entire existence. There's bubble bees and there's lava. So there's three things that we need to avoid in this one, which is a little bit concerning. Okay, um, ooh, think, 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 think. Okay, okay, so I'm thinking, this is what we do. We're gonna circle this, right? We're gonna circle this, and then we're gonna protect Blue. Blue has been protected. Everybody is safe. Oh, that's literally all you have to do in this game. You just have to circle all of the bad things, and then nobody gets hurt. It's, it's literally like creating an invisible force field around everything. Like, I used to do at recess when I was younger. All right, there are three blues. All right, uh, don't worry, you button-eyed, blue-faced, drooling, crown, beautiful blue peoples. I will save you. All right, now I gotta figure out exactly how to save them. All right, I'm actually kind of curious. Can I draw over here? Whoa, 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 look at that. Oh, yeah, look at that. We can go everywhere. Whoa, 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 whoa. I did it. Did I do it? I think I did it. <laughs> it looks like an octopus is going up, up and down. That was actually great. Collect all three stars? No, if I only need one star to get to the next level, I honestly don't even care about getting three stars. Like for this one, we could go like this, we go like that, we go like that, we go like that, we go like this, this, this. We could literally make an entire house. I can make like windows down here. We can make a front door right there. We can make more windows over here. Problem is it, it needs to be like one line. So that's a little bit of an issue for me. And there we go. We made an entire house that will protect both of the brothers that are down here in the basement and the bumblebees will stay up top. What the heck is this? All right, so that top one has some spikes. That's rude. Um, all right, how do we protect them? Let's actually just make the most impenetrable force field. Make it big. Bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger. No, you're not touching this man. Look at that. The spikes can't even get even one inch forward. This game is so easy if you don't care about the stars. Okay, level 23. It looks like all of the blues are probably going to fall down on each other. Oh, no, they're, they're not. Okay, okay, okay. What I'm thinking to do in this level is to literally just make a maze for them. So I'm going to make a maze for the bees. And I'm going to see just how smart they are. So we're going to have it come up there. We go back down here. Uh, How do I do this? Um, I think if I make it really close, they're going to be able to get past. So we're going to make it go like here up here and then out here and then i think what i have to do is like connect it up here so that it like stays i don't know what they're gonna do here <laughs> never mind they, they they actually just got blocked right there and i made probably the weirdest creation of all time i still passed the level so i don't want to hear it i don't know what the blue guy did to deserve all of the bumblebees rage and hate maybe they're just rage and hateful who knows or the maybe the blue guy did something to the queen bee that we will not talk about. Who knows? I don't. We're gonna go like that. Okay. All right. I, I think we beat this level. I honestly feel like I could beat these levels with my eyes closed half of the time. All right. What do we do here? We're gonna make something that goes like that. Goes like this. Goes like that. Goes like this. And like that. <laughs> Wait, they're going around. There was a little opening that they could have gotten through, but they didn't. Of course, they didn't go through because they don't know how to do things right. This one's easy. You can just circle them. Look at that. Look at that. The bumblebees are in their own bumblebee circle. The bumblebee cage. And they will never touch blue again. Time I kind of want to draw like a stick figure. We're gonna go like that. That'll be like the leg. Um, this will be the body, I guess, coming up. We'll have like a, a head right there, a little arm. Then we'll have another arm that's circling around the, the rainbow stick figure. Just like that. He's saving him. He saved his life. Thank you, stick man. What would we ever do without you? Probably die. Probably get eaten alive or stung to death by the killer bumblebees. We're still not entirely sure why the killer bumblebees are killer bumblebees, but we're just gonna, we're just gonna act like they are. All right, this time around, we're going to, I guess, circle the top part of you. Uh, we're going to make a, a body that's just lying down. Lying down body. Oh, no, I've fallen and, and can't get up. Oh, no. Don't worry. I'll help you down here. But And then we go like that. And we do an arm and an arm and then legs. And there we, we have two bodies that have fallen and they're connected by a tether at the head. And it worked. It actually worked. I could literally do anything in this game and it's going to work. I don't care that we didn't get three stars, okay? I understand you want your three stars, but I'm not giving it to you. Oh, wait, this one's kind of crazy. Okay, uh, what am I thinking here? What happens? Okay, they all fall. We actually almost won that one. Okay, 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 okay. So we need to make sure not to connect anything to these guys because it's just gonna fall right okay all right what if i just like zigzag in between them okay we can't zigzag that one we're gonna zigzag this one that one this one that one this one 
What happens here? I think I just made the Pokemon ditto. <laughs> and, it, and it worked. It worked again. We're too good at this game. Okay, this time around, we're gonna make their their structure out of the head of a giant stick man. Because that's all I know how to draw are stick peoples. All right, there we go. We're gonna just color that in. And whoa, he's got a balloon head. <laughs> <laughs> and then we're gonna we're gonna give him big old ears big ear there some hair and then a big ear there There he is the sideways headed stick man. Oh that, that worked out great. That was perfect Couldn't have done it any better myself. I did it myself anyway <laughs> Also, I'm getting coins, and I have no idea what the coins even do. Okay, apparently there's 900 coins that I can collect, and over 300 different levels to play. If you guys want to see more, make sure you smash the like button, subscribe so you don't miss out, and also comment down below uh, your favorite type of pancakes.